Hey guys, happy Friday. I am so glad it's Friday. I do work tomorrow from 8.45 to 4.45, but that's no big deal because I really, really like the beauty supply store job. <clears throat> Excuse me, my voice is all scratchy. I haven't talked in a little bit. I just got home from work a little while ago, and today is going to be Ipsy Bag Unbagging Unboxing Day, whatever you want to call it. Um, so I kind of cheated. I already took the bag out because I am using my phone instead of my flip cam because it's being ever so cooperative today as you all well know um so I don't have a tripod up is the point of this so I only have one free hand so I kind of had to get into everything and like open it so I can like show it to you with one hand so do excuse me this is the state of my ipsy bag right now it has totally been unzipped and everything like I said I was trying to be preemptive Ooh, the hot pink of the bag is doing terrible things to my face color wise interesting um, sorry, I get distracted easily. I really do need better lighting. But this is the Ipsy bag for the month of July. It, um, it's kind of water resistant. It's like fuzzy on the inside, but it's like plasticky on the outside. It's got these cute like scalloped edges. And because it's at the top of the bag, here is the first thing that I received. This is the Bare Minerals 5-in-1 BB Advanced Performance Cream Eyeshadow Broad Spectrum SPF 15. That's what this is. There are so many pretty colors available, you guys. Here, look at the inside of the package. See all those bright colors, all those pretty peaches and pinks up at the top? Mine's brown. It's in Divine Wine, which is like the grayest brown. Normally I love taupe, but like for nail polish, not for eyeshadow. What am I going to do with that? I don't know if I'm going to keep it or not. I haven't even tried it yet, but if any of you think you're more of a taupe eyeshadow person than me, leave a comment below. I don't know. I don't know. So yeah do like the brand, do like the product, even like the color, but a little iffy with my skin. I'm kind of pale. Um, the next thing I received is actually the thing that I am the most excited about, but again, because the bag's all like jumbly wobbly and my other hand is indisposed. I'll take it out now. It's already open. It is a nail polish by a brand called Wet, W-H-E-T, which I have never heard of before today. Oh, I've heard of the word though. Okay, yeah, I just got the definition of the word wet. It says to stimulate curiosity, appetite, and desire. I already knew that, but I didn't think about why they were calling their polish wet. Anyway, the color is heh, facetious. It's a word my friend Nathan used to use all the time. Facetious. 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 It's pretty. Um, it's more indigo than it looks on camera. On camera it looks more navy blue. It's probably going to be a Corelli. It's probably going to be a... Peter to work with, but it's a gorgeous color by a brand I've never heard of, so that's cool. Um, the next thing in my Ipsy bag for the month of July is the Be Fine Food Skin Care Daily Moisturizer with SPF 15 with rosemary, pomegranate, and rice. They really want to make sure I don't sunburn because this um, has SPF 15, the eyeshadow has SPF 15. They had sent me a Hang 10 50 SPF uh, sunscreen a few bags back I believe but I just gave that to Megan yesterday because she's playing golf tomorrow at like 10 a.m. and if you're playing golf at like 10 a.m. for like four hours you need that whole tube of 50 SPF sunblock because I'll be darned if she gets cooked like a lobster so hopefully she uses the whole tube up um, thumbs up for sunblock y'all but yeah this is not sunblock it's got SPF 15 in it but it is be fine food Skin Care Daily Moisturizer with SPF and rice and pomegranate and rosemary. Sounds delicious. Making me hungry. I'm iffy on moisturizers, um, skincare products in general. I get so many complimentary products from the store I work at to try, and my skin is looking a lot better, so I'm grateful for that, but I don't want to keep switching it up, although this one says allergen-free, fragrance-free, and paraben-free, and a big reason that my skin is so broken out all the time, I think, is because I strip the oils. Because it's so oily, I like you know, use toners and alcohol and dry it out and then my skin overcompensates and creates more oil and does things like this. But it's a lot better today. It's a lot better. So anyway, yeah, moisturizer. It was a long video. I'm sorry, guys. But I guess I'm just excited to talk to you. I miss you. Um, <clears throat> I was talking with my mom earlier today and I guess she must have just seen that news article about, like, selfies being linked to addiction and narcissism and I think she equates my vlogs with like extended selfies but it's not about me filming myself looking great it's about me talking to you guys whether I feel like I look great or not and I feel pretty good about myself today although I have put on five pounds and I am not wearing makeup and I'm still here talking to you because I don't really care um it's not because I like the sound of my own voice I actually don't um I in my head it sounds really good when I 
hear recordings, I like cringe. That's what I sound like. But that's a whole other story. I'm digressing. This is supposed to be an ipsy unbagging, not a vlog. Whatever, you guys know I combine it like crazy. Anyway, this is Hang 10 Dark Tanning Oil Natural Sunscreen SPF 8 Protection Water Resistant for 40 Minutes. Hang 10 Suntan Oil, which is actually a cool product. But the only parts of me that are, the t that are tan are the parts I don't even want tan, like my face, because I'm not protecting it enough. And my decollete, is that how you say it? Look at that. Look at the difference in the color. I'm all red in the chest from my v-necks and walking to a doctor, doctor's office every day. And ugh. Anyway, I'm not going to tan. I need to protect my skin better. Look how white my legs are compared to my chest. It's a whole discrepancy. But yeah, I'm sitting here in pajamas, so whatever. Even longer video, guys. You better be loving it. Hang 10 tanning oil. I'm sending this ooh, to Abby because she received one in her Ipsy bag and she said she was going to be using it. So she can have mine too. And then she can use twice as much. Um, the very last thing in my Ipsy bag is a Pixie Tinted Brilliance Balm in the color Unique Pink. Looks like this. It looks just like a lip balm crayon, like a chapstick or something. It doesn't look like it's got a color at all, although the sticker is colored but this looks like fleshy. Anyway, I'm excited about that. I had never heard of Pixie ever before in life until I met Abby. Um, she sent me some Pixie things and now that I have my glam bag subscription, I do get Pixie products often. I've only used a couple, I've liked what I've used. But yeah, that is everything for the month of July for the Ipsy bag, plus some random thoughts from yours truly. I need to redo my nails, they are still whatever that color is called by Zoya that I put on a few days ago and I love it, but I think it'd be smarter to not redo them until after I work tomorrow because I unpack boxes for a living half the time and if I get my nails all pretty today I'm just gonna end up touching stuff tomorrow and like chipping one or scratching one or whatever so probably save it even though I'm anxious and I don't like that I can't do my nails twice a week anymore or I could but there's just no point because I'd destroy them. Okay this video is seven minutes long it was supposed to be like two or three supposed to be. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and if you made it all the way to the end Today's secret word is cronut, so say that below if you made it, even if you've already put in a comment. I don't care. I love you guys. I will talk to you tomorrow. Thank you for watching. Bye.